friends today we are going to discuss HTML uh, 5 concept okay as well as we are going to discuss about uh, structural markup type of language HTML is the one of the uh, markup type of language okay actually I want to show uh, its importance right most of beginners I always mm, ask like uh, what is the purpose of HTML why we use HTML or mm, you can say usage of HTML um, see on internet on web there are million trillion number of website exist okay who gives different type of services to the end users okay so uh, see this is a Google website it's a search engine there are different type of search engine uh, like Yahoo search engine Google search engine then um, DuckDuckGo so there are uh, different types which is comes under search engine category right these all websites execute these all website running on particular browser okay as well as it require proper web server right I will show you how to use mm, where exactly use this type of uh, HTML language see simply if you want to check um, its uses then simply right click over um, particular website and check view page source okay nothing else <coughs> see there are a different number of tag behavior okay I will show you let me zoom in right this is the HTML right within opening and closing uh, within yes op within opening and closing angular bracket when you provide any type of text which is simply is called as a tag okay so this is the HTML tag now this is a head tag right <coughs> this is a meta tag okay there are different type of so many lines let me scroll see at the end body tag clothes and HTML clothes actually we already discussed about um, structure of HTML into last video right so in that we uh, discuss how to use uh, structure means first is a head uh, sorry first is a HTML tag next head tag title uh, title text okay any type of statement title tag clothes head tag clothes body tag open body content body tag close and HTML close so in this way there are actually there are two sections first is a head section and second is a body section okay so, so body section is the actual uh, area okay actually display area we can say so this is a just page source okay let me zoom out okay so this is about Google site let me show you another website shopping website see this is Amazon it's a well-known website okay who gives mm, shopping facility to um, different number of users okay you can uh, purchase any kind of products through Amazon this is another uh, website there's another website like flipkart.com see this is a flipkart I will uh, if I right click over there and select view page source then it will display actual markup structure okay this is the markup structure see uh, HTML tag head tag then 
and let me show you at the end definitely there is a body tag clothes and HTML tag clothes okay now next our um, institute website Yandip okay this is a Bhargao campus right then this is a Morvan de Boros campus English medium school okay so um, there are different type of categories when you talk about um, websites when you talk about web pages okay HTML basically HTML is used to develop static page HTML is used to develop designing okay design of for particular uh, page okay look and feel if you want to in make interactive then uh, we um, we can use uh, different type of scripting language different type of programming okay HTML is everywhere when you talk about website and web page right very interesting site is this w3schools.com in that there are different type of mm, you can say tutorials we can learn through this website okay HTML JavaScript jQuery angular JS node.js Ajax there are so many different type of um, web programming web you can say web designing type of uh, resources available on this w3schools.com so uh, there are different type of categories okay when you talk about website or web page right so uh, HTML and HTML5 okay HTML5 is what HTML5 is a uh, we can say latest uh, version of HTML okay actually in 1991 dr. T Berners-Lee introduced uh, web standards okay and in 1993 um, they implement into uh, w3c okay there are different type of um, versions HTML we can say HTML 1 HTML 2 3 4 HTML 4 is called as a web 1.0 and HTML 5 it is also called as a web 2.0 okay so introduction to HTML 5 HTML is a start uh, standard ma language for developing and recreating interactive websites introduced by team Bernersley dr. team Bernersley HTML documents are created in any text editor for and uh, for and can be run on any computer that has a web browser okay uh, here is one uh, name text editor now what do you mean by text editor text editor is the application text editor is a program where we're going to enter uh, HTML code okay HTML source code so simply click on start click on programs menu accessories and simply click on notepad see notepad is uh, one of the text editor which is available on windows os in uh, by default available on windows platform so you just click on that notepad application so this is text editor okay in that we can type uh, different type of tag behavior because uh, HTML is a markup type of language okay so in H when you talk about HTML4 then this is starts with HTML tag actually there are um, two different section head section okay and next part is body section right hello 
roots html okay within head section we can use one title title for um, document right and now any type of title mm, title goes, goes title goes here okay you can say then title tag clothes head tag clothes body tag and in that actually it's a display area right so you can write uh, body content content goods here so in this way uh, you can create structure okay there is one doc type declaration in um, HTML4 it's difficult to write doc type declaration exclamatory mark doc type then there are different type of you, you require different type of attributes different type of um, words keywords reserve words to implement it's difficult to implement okay but now in HTML5 it is very easier okay it is very easy for uh, beginners who wants to learn HTML okay HTML designing or we can say markup type of language so let's start introduction to HTML now basic structure HTML tags are keywords enclosed within angular brackets that define how your web browser must format and display the content tags are not case sensitive every HTML page is enclosed within two tags HTML open and HTML close okay how can I identify S simply it's a opening HTML tag without forward slash okay and this is called as closing HTML tag why it's called as closing because there is a forward slash okay right so HTML is a pair type of tag there are different type of actually we discuss uh, we are going to discuss about uh, these different type of categories of HTML okay different type of tag behavior so mm, uh, this page is divided into two sections internally head section and body section head section contains the title of document which is enclosed within title and title clothes of head and head clothes the actual text of document is written within body tag open and body tag clothes okay so simply it's, ca it's called as a body tag open and body tag clothes okay now attribute concept an attribute defines a property for an element consists of an attribute or value and appears within the elements start tag remember one thing attribute always use inside opening tag okay sometime we need additional information with a tag then we use attribute concept see HTML tag open, head tag open, title, first page, head tag close, body, BG color. See, this is the attribute concept. Okay, body is a tag. Now, how to use attribute? By giving space. Okay, body, space, BG color equals to value. This is the color value. BG color means background color. Okay. And after that, body tag clothes and HTML clothes right this is a structure now next part is classification of HTML tags actually there are two type of uh, categorize we can say HTML tags are categorized as container and empty type of tag container means container tags are also called as pair tags container tags have beginning tag and 
end tag. The end tag is similar to the beginning tag but with a forward slash in front of it. For example, head open and head close. So this is called as a container. Why it's called as a container? Because which contain the head contains title. Okay, title for uh, document. Okay, title of document. And then empty tags. Empty tags are standalone tags and do not have an end tag. Okay, it is also called as a singular tag. There is a one of the empty type of tag. Okay. Uh, now there are different type of tags which are used in um, HTML structure, HTML mar this markup language. Okay. When you use this in text editor, it will it will surely applied. It will surely interpret on web browser. Web browser can easily understand markup or we can say source code okay it will interpret exactly output to the user okay now basic structure of HTML purpose of tags see this is the purpose of HTML and close HTML what is the purpose of HTML this tag indicates that the document is an HTML file okay which type of file HTML file which type of document is there HTML document is there now head tag open and head tag close purpose it includes title within it <coughs> the text within head is not this <coughs> it includes title so within opening and closing head All right actually <coughs> um, head section is specially used for SEO process SEO search engine optimization when you want to mm, rank your particular page rank your proper website in search engine okay then at that time we use SEO process and mm, which is depend on which type of keyword we use which type of statement okay which type of description which type of author name okay so these things comes under SEO concept okay actually it's a part of digital marketing uh, then next point is title tag and title tag close uh, the content within this tag is displayed on the title bar now next concept is body tag open and body tag close this tag includes all content which is to be developed in the web browser most of the tags are included in this tag now structure of web page using HTML file I already told you HTML is a sim plain HTML is a which is called as HTML4 okay and now this is the HTML file it's a new technology we can say it's a new uh, version of HTML the first line of the on the top doc type HTML which is called as doc type declaration okay and it lets the browser know the flavor of HTML okay so this statement is mandatory okay let me show you uh, when you talk about HTML5 okay we need to apply exclamatory mark doc type and HTML right this statement is this is very easy to implement when when you talk about HTML5 okay but in case of HTML4 there is a there are different type of keywords this there are different type of attributes okay it's a lengthy uh, statement as compared to the HTML5 okay so HTML5 is very easy to implement easy to learn okay so just type this statement which is called as a doc type declaration okay now HTML tag head tag title head tag close body tag open 
body contain goes here and body type close and html goes right uh, let me show you if i save this file you you know um, exactly extension of extension for html file dot html or dot htm okay so um, we need to enter file name and then extension okay uh, it's a trial program so let me create one folder okay <coughs> name for folder name like 11 science okay inside it uh, we want to and we want to uh, set proper name okay uh, simply trial dot html now here dot html is the extension of html file and trial is what trial is a file name okay so simply save this file into folder okay and now 11 let me select this folder just double click on mm, uh, this this is a chrome right i will show you let me increase this yes this is a chrome right uh, we can say icon if i click on if i double click or simply select right click on select and select open then see this is let me close other sites okay see title goes here okay and now this is a body content area actual display area so body content goes here okay so <coughs> anything uh, inside this body tag open and close which is simply displays on a uh, browser okay if i enter 11 class okay in class sorry happy coding loading okay so if i click on if i save this file control plus s or simply click on save button okay and if i refresh it fi then see x r 11 class happy coding <coughs> and body content goes here text okay there is one um, tag if I use br tag after this br okay okay actually I want to um, <coughs> set this line okay after coding okay or, or new line then simply refresh it see if I refresh or reload then So this is the uh, doctor declaration. Now next part is program. See, doc type HTML, HTML tag open, and there are different type of tag behavior. Okay, uh, header section, nav section, um, then section tag, article tag. Okay, aside footer. Actually, these are semantic type of tags, okay. But remember these things: body tag close and HTML close. So this is a fixed structure, okay. This is fixed structure of HTML. This is fixed. We can say this is fixed structure of HTML file, okay. Hope you understand uh, this basic and 
importance of HTML okay surely we discuss about semantic tags and different tag behavior different attributes okay into next one okay take care bye bye